night as they lay in their beds, wondering what joy tomorrow might bring, yet knowing how precarious life can be, they repeated the words, Your fate is not yet sealed. Even in the darkest night, a star will shine, a bell will chime, a path will be revealed. I'm so excited to tell you about Echo. So this is a book by Pam Munoz Ryan, um, and I read it a few years ago, and I still, it still haunts me. I still think about it. And so this is a book about three preteens who um, went through some very difficult times in history, and then you find out how they made choices to impact the world around them. And they're all tied together through one harmonica. And so it's a really awesome story. It's great for fans of fantasy. It's great for fans of historical fiction. Um, it's great for people who like to read books about relationships and how people interact with each other. Just anybody that wants to read a good book. I really think you should read Echo. Have you ever played hide and seek in the forest and gotten lost? Echo begins with Otto in an enchanted forest where he gets lost playing hide and seek and meets three sisters who send him on an important task with a harmonica as a messenger. We travel with the harmonica to three separate places and see its impact. Our story first moves to Nazi Germany with Friedrich, who experiences Hitler's rise to power and the accompanying heartbreaking injustices. How will he be able to help his family? How will music help him to overcome? Next, we travel to Pennsylvania and spend time with Orphan and Mike, who must protect his brother because there's no one else who will. How does the harmonica affect his life? Finally, the harmonica goes to Ivy in California, whose brother is away at war. She tries to hold her family together in spite of forces trying to pull them apart. How does music help her find her way? Although Echo is a book that deals with difficult topics, it's still a book that's filled with hope. Hope of the power of music and about choosing to do the right thing even when it's really hard. Um, one of my favorite quotes from the book says, he felt protected by the cloak of music, as if nothing could stand in his way. I'll let you read and find out which character it's talking about. The book also has a fantastic audio version, which I highly recommend. Um, it has four different narrators for the different parts of the book, and it, of course it contains fantastic music. So I really hope that you choose to read this book, and I would love to hear what you think about it. Thanks. <music>